words. There we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> oh, technology is not working for me today. Okay, we're there. Good, good. Uh, looks like we're in the right spot for you guys to see me. Hello, M. Hey. <laughs> this this microphone is. Um. Are you guys hearing me? Okay. It, does it sound like the microphone is on? Hopefully, hopefully it's on and it's working okay. It looks like it should be working okay. Awesome. Thank you, Bree Bree. And hello, Haley. So glad to have you all here today. Um, if you're new, I'm Karen from collectpeanuts.com, my website that I've been making for like 20 years. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, so obviously I collect peanuts. And uh, welcome fellow Peanuts fans. Today we're gonna look at some upcoming content here. I finally got this Atlantis Snoopy is Joe Cool surfboard kit. Molly is staring at me. Let's see if I can get her to come over. Molly is my dog, if you're not familiar. Uh, what did we do with your biscuits? There they are. Oh, well, that's on the floor now. Would you like a biscuit? I don't know that there's room to show you on camera. Would you like a biscuit? She's giving me that, like, uh. <laughs> You gonna come over here? You want a biscuit? Show your face? It's a live stream. What's this? No. Uh -oh. Come around the other way. Come around the other way. Come here. Over here. Over here. Over here. <laughs> Molly, like, what's this? Get your get your head over here. You can like see her shadow. Like, I know the live stream's a little delayed for the devices. Come here, come here. What's this? <laughs> well, now you know she was there. Uh oh. Can you grumble? Oh no. Now Rose is coming. We're, we're dog sitting. Yeah, here you go. Oh. <laughs> I knew the biscuit, but it bounced. And that wasn't good. That one's gone forever. There we go. That's it. That's all the biscuits you're getting. So yeah, you can see a little bit of her head. There we go. There's, there's dog. <laughs> just just leave it alone rosa all right back to our regular regularly scheduled content other dogs uh yeah so i got this snoopy model kit so i'm gonna have to put this together uh word to the wise don't buy these off of amazon because you can hopefully see that this box is terribly damaged. They just sent it in a bag. I'm not too happy about that. So I don't know, buy it, buy it in person. I know Joanne's, the craft store sometimes has these, uh, but you know, maybe there's a model store near you if you want one. So don't buy it off of Amazon. Unless you want to support this channel. Uh, then I don't know if I've showed this yet. 
uh, I did a video on the Snoopy Snow Cone machine, and then I got the brilliant idea I should do a comparison of the original Snoopy Snow Cone machine with the new version. This is very different. So that's coming up eventually. Maybe more of a summertime thing. Oh my goodness, there's a ton of people here. Hello, M. Stimson, Bobby Wolf, Bisbee. Debbie, hello, hello. We also have Peanuts Holiday Lights coming up. As you might know, I like doing puzzles. And this one has lights. So you can see down here, this one's by Rose Art. Um, I did get this one off of Amazon and the box showed up fine. Uh, so yeah, gonna do this puzzle for Christmas. So, you know, <laughs> subscribe so you can see that. And Eight months? Nine months? Eight months. Nine months? I don't know. All right. So hopefully we are going to have battery power for two boxes. And just so you know, Rosa is right down there. And she's kind of close to the tripod. So hopefully she doesn't like abruptly get up and knock everything over. <laughs> I see Molly has a toy. She's a little out of sorts because there's another dog in the house and she's used to being an only dog. Anyway, so we're going to hopefully be able to do two boxes. But we're going to start with, I, I'm pretty sure this is a favorite. I forgot to look, but I looked earlier today and everyone, well, not everyone, a vast majority voted for the box of toys. So that's what we're gonna look at today. These are from my collection. And I've seen these before. So I, I know what's in here, but I, I don't know what's in here because I packed it away a long time ago and it's nice to revisit these since I don't have room to put everything on display. Here's a official Snoopy Tosserino. This is from the 70s, I believe. This is by Aviva. It's weird that it's, it's still got the bag, but not the like header. See there, it says Aviva. Very cute. They had other colors and I think other designs. I think the other color was white. And we have this little guy, I should, I should really try and get this guy working. Uh, he blows bubbles. Uh, you put him in the water like this and he, I think he floats or he maybe motors around. So I got to give this thing a try. I don't know if I've ever had it working. I'm hopefully going to build a little workshop where I can try and fix things. <laughs> try and get Alan to fix things. <laughs> it's a matter of time, you know. Always need more time. Here's the Snoopy Pup tent. This is really cute. This is for your tiny plush dolls. I don't know if I've ever had this out. Okay, there's some pulls in here. Oh, I should set this up sometime. We've got tent pulls. And we have the actual tent here. Very, very cute. And on the other side, there's a little, there's a little flap so you can have air coming into your tent. I, I love how realistic it is. I, I'm not sure if vinyl would be a great material for a tent, but you know, whatever works for a kid's toy. Get that all together. Oh, color forms. It's nice to find these because I know I have extra. 
Oh, it's so perfect. Now, if you're not familiar with color forms, they're basically these sticky pieces of plastic that you put on this little scene here. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, but they're not, like they say they stick like magic, but it's disappointing. So this is Carry On Nurse Lucy. Oh, there's more in here. We'll go to that first. We've got a puzzle here. Very lovely. You know, me and my puzzles. I think I've got an extra one of these. Now I know where both of them are, so I can definitely sell one. Yeah, Molly's like scrounging around upstairs, so I'm just like, what is she doing? She might be jealous. We have the Peanuts play set. Another color form here. <laughs> Is there more to it? Oh, there's a little bit. Very incomplete. We can play with this one. I'm gonna have to do that. They are kind of fun to play with, even though the pieces do not stick. What's also fun is mixing up multiple sets from multiple genres. I did that with a Batman one once because I had a bunch of like extra pieces that I got. Highly recommend. Oh, here's the topper for the Tossarino. Wonder why they called it Tossarino. It's very Italian sounding. Maybe that was a brand? Or they were just trying to come up with something other than Frisbee since you have to call them flying discs. Yes, Alan, Alan helps. I just all of a sudden noticed his name. <laughs> oh. Hello, Alan. Also, I don't know if I said hello to Bobby. Welcome, welcome. Another color form set. I know what I'm doing. Snoopy and Belle. Oh, here we go. This one, this one's fun because it's got like a little stand, so you could like display this on a shelf. Okay, we got we got some loose pieces in here, so Let's look at all that. I don't know if it's this exact set, but I did take a some photos, of the outfits on Snoopy and Belle. It, it was kind of fun to do. <laughs> Look at all this. All these color forms. We have a Snoopy and Woodstock play set. Oh, this one, this one needs a little rearrangement. Not too bad, though. We've got our traditional dog house. And then all these nice pieces. We got a Sally in there. So many Snoopies. What is that? Five? And it looks like five Woodstocks, including one on a bike. That's nice. This was originally $2.29. Now, this is probably from the early 80s, I'm guessing. Um, to be a broken record, any copyright dates might not be correct on Peanuts items. Molly's barking. Alan, did she see you? <laughs> Everybody say thanks to Alan for trying to not set off the dog during my live stream. Thanks, Alan. Here we have a Disco Snoopy, one of my favorite sets. I mean... Look, look at that. I just love it. Here we go. Look at that dance floor. Woo! That actually kind of looks like it's straight out of Flash Beagle, which is the shirt I'm wearing today. I, I made this shirt because one did not exist. 
Here you can see other sets. So there's Holly Hobby, Batman, Raggedy Ann, Mickey, Bert and Ernie, Cookie Monster, Barbie. I have x-ray vision. Did you, did you guys know that? <laughs> All right. Luckily, Molly has stopped. Rosa has vacated. And here we have the Lionel train car. Oh, and 027, 027 gauge operating hand car. I don't, I don't know train stuff, but this is like an actual train car that you can put on a train set. If you have these two gauges or one of these gauges, I don't know. There is also a Snoopy and Woodstock version. We might have it somewhere, but I don't really know. So... I'm gonna have to look that up. Oh, oh, <gasps> no. Oh, the tapes come undone and then it's got stuck to another box. Part of me. <sighs> Did not work. It's not a big deal. It's on the bottom. Nobody's gonna see. All right. Snoopy monitor topper. I think you could also put this on uh, a car antenna. This is from like the early 2000s. Free dangler included. That's weird. Some Somebody wrote on the back of the box, woohoo for the free dangler. Maybe it's an inside joke I don't get. Uh, or maybe they just really like danglers. Here we have a mini walking Snoopy from Aviva. Look at this box. It's so beautiful, except for that spot that just got ripped off. It is what it is. These aren't particularly rare in the box. Oh, guess what's inside? Look who we have. <laughs> She's come out of the box. Um, yeah, there we go. We've got Belle. Look at her. She's lovely. Her sticker eyes are a little freaky though, because they're they just like poke up a little bit. So they I don't know, they just have this really like <sighs> words cannot describe how poofy her eyes are. Oh, which one's this? The world's greatest cook. Uh, I do have a video of this running on the channel, so definitely check that out. Uh, if you're not familiar, basically you wind him up and then he, he flips his pan and like the, the egg like flips over. It's pretty cool. And you can also see the other ones here. We've got the champ, he's a boxer, and the drummer. I also have videos of those two. All right, we have some playing cards here. Oh! What? Looks like somebody couldn't pick between the two boxes of Linus cards, so she just kept both of them. I, I gotta sell one of these. Or maybe both of them. I might have an even better box now. These are from Hallmark, probably 1970s. And jumping forward in time, we have these from Hoyle. Good old Hoyle. Do you have a date? No. Nope. Oh, 2003. That's when these are from. 
And to go with those, we have th three table tallies for um, bridge, I think. I don't really know. Yes. As I have said before, I don't, I don't know how to play bridge, oddly enough. But I can play sheep's head if anybody wants to play. I will need to refresh my memory. We have a little train here. This is probably a Viva. Yep. What are th you'd think there'd be more pieces. Maybe this one doesn't have more pieces because it doesn't have like a little thing on the back to attach more pieces. I think this probably used to be friction, but it is not working anymore. So with friction vehicles, you would pull them back and then they would shoot forward. Like this one. This is also a friction car. Does it... I don't think this one would... would I don't think this one would work either. I don't think that's the right Snoopy. Huh. It's definitely a Viva, but I think this might be a child guidance one. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm overthinking this. <laughs> Molly, could you be quiet and not scare your mama? Oh, uh, I just want to let Alan know that Molly has somehow gotten the toys out of the outdoor toy box. She is currently walking around with Squirrel. That's our Molly. Oh, this poor thing broke. Oh, man. It's probably just old plastic. We have a Snoopy wind-up walker. He is huge. Remember, this is the, the box for Belle. And his um, wind-up broke off a bit here, unfortunately. So I'm gonna have to glue that back together. Oh, it goes like that. Unless it was already broken, it's hard to tell. It should go back together okay. It just needs some glue. That's what I do here. Just fix all the old collectibles. He's very cute, isn't he? I wonder I wonder if his shirt is supposed to say Joe Cool. You know, I, I think I have the technology now that I could recreate that if it needs it. What else we got? Oh! There's another bell. This time she is in a package on the card. Again, Aviva. Same eyes. D different bow, I think. Now I gotta look. I gotta look. <laughs> oh yeah, that is a very different bow. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but the one that I pulled out of the box is like a very long bowl. And yeah, other than that, they look the same. These are the little things that I notice and then I save versions because that's what I do. Okay. Oh no. Uh, I think that's it for this box, so I'm going to clear up some stuff. Uh, yeah. Does anybody have any questions while I pack some of this away? Nothing like to try to pack things away yet at the same time, like look at the um, 
the screen down here. Put this in here. Okay. We can do this. <laughs> it gets really tight right here because I've got the, the tripod set up and it's like literally like two feet from my neck and then I've got a little thing set up with the iPad on it so I can see the comments make sure I'm in frame or whatever okay oh, I should have a scissor here scissor Scissor, scissor. Did I steal my own scissor? Are we gonna have to do this the old fashioned way? I think so. Here we go. Well, they use good tape at Snoopy's Gallery and Gift Shop. Come on. If you're not familiar, Snoopy's Gathering Gift Shop is at like the mecca of Snoopy stuff in Santa Rosa, California. So you got the Schultz Museum, you've got the Snoopy's Home Ice, the Redwood Empire Ice Arena, and then you've got Snoopy's Gathering Gift Shop. If someday you get the chance to go, go. Get over there. Go visit. Tell them I say hi. And they'll be like, who? <laughs> no, they, they might know me. Who knows? Um, anyway, so they, I don't know if they still do this, but they used to put out mystery boxes for people to buy. So I, I bought some for me and Mom to open, but we just, we haven't been getting together as much. And when we do, it tends to be, um, you know other things going on so we just haven't opened boxes um so i'm gonna open myself because i want to and i paid for them. uh yeah anyway so this is going to be new stuff from who knows where including this make happy fun peanuts snoopy festival bag this is definitely from japan from 2022, so that's fairly new. Oh, that is that a silica gel packet? Dry clay craft. Ooh. Where, where, uh. <laughs> I'll put it down here. All right. I'm gonna have lots of crinkly stuff. This is a bag. This looks like a really nice bag. It's really heavy. Like for this size, it's really heavy. Okay, I'm gonna have to open this because it looks really cute. You can see on the front there, it says Snoopy and Woodstock. They've got the official tag there. This is by Wen Pine International Company. I haven't heard of that one. Oh yeah, look at 
that? It's got a big long handle. Oh. <laughs> Look at all those pockets. Oh, and it's got like a zipper one in the middle. There's like two, three? No, two, po two pockets in there. And then there's like a credit card section there. Oh, and there's another zippered in there. Wow. That is a fabulous bag. And it's it's got such a like small profile, you know? <laughs> you don't get that with your fancy coach bags or whatever. I don't know, maybe you do. I'm, I'm, I, I'm, I don't have the money for that stuff. Oh, a snooty. <laughs> I love this stuff. I don't think there's actual tea in here, but these little tins are so cute. This is from Japan again. I'm going to give it a sniff. It does not smell. That's too bad. But maybe it's for the best. Who knows? Mine might not like this blend of tea. Very cute. See what we have here. Is this a soap dispenser? Kid milk amino acid cover, wash and shampoo. What? I'm going to repeat that again. Kid milk, amino acid cover, wash and shampoo. Uh, this appears to be Chinese. Yeah, I think this is Chinese or Mandarin. Uh, yeah, so you can see the back here. So I think maybe this had shampoo in it at one time and they took it out. That is so strange, but you could totally use that as a soap dispenser. Very cute. I like this color scheme too, which is probably why it is on my website. <laughs> All right, moving on. Oh, what's this? Hello, little friends. What is this? Look at this thing. This is what I always cut out of these mystery unboxings. I don't, I don't know. Okay, I think you, maybe it's a polish? No. What? It says jointy on the back, 2022, Japan. Well, that's a mystery to solve another day. Oh, oh, you see, I don't know if you can see right there, but I think this is a stamper. You would push down on the top and it would stamp st something. Okay, mystery solved. We have, oh, a two-way cushion. Oh, there you go. It looks like there's another cushion inside. So you have like a travel cushion or maybe you fold it inside out. This is by Afternoon Tea 2023. So this is, this is also in Japanese. So I'm gonna have to get that out and see how it works. But not right now, because it's very crinkly. We have, oh, a Snoopy Home Ice pen. Oh, I thought it was going to light up. <laughs> Maybe it, oh, I think it does. Oh, it does. I, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it does. It, it's blue. You see that? There's like just a little bit of blue at the bottom. 
Uh, if you don't see it, you're just going to have to take my word for it. But it does light up. That's cool. Okay. This looks like a wallet. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. Very tiny. Big enough for credit cards. Oh, you can put your like keys or whatever in there. Is there is there a brand? Do we get a brand? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Come on. Ooh. This is a 2023 Palm Ink. Oh, like pomme de terre, which is potato in French, I believe. Earth apple. <laughs> so that palm name means apple. In case you're wondering. But this is from Japan. Okay, we don't have to close it. We have a tiny little gift bag that says for you. 2017 peanuts. What's in here? Oh, an ear cuff. I was not aware of anything like this uh, existing. Oh, it's got wood stock on it. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but we will jam it in the, the lens. It is gold. It's like the teeny tiniest little wood stock. I would be able to wear that because I don't have pierced ears. Or I could put it in my nose. What do you guys think about that? That could be my new look. We have an umbrella. Now we can't open this in the house. This is also from Japan. Glass fiber, whatever that means. Uh, let's see, 2023 by, I don't know. I can't read. Japanese when it's in weird fonts. And I'm very, very bad at any Japanese. So, yeah. We're, that, that's a lovely umbrella. <laughs> I don't know who made it. I wish I could tell you. Oh, here we've got some more bell for you guys. Peanuts in, at the Shirakawago. Shirakaga. I'm just gonna let you read it. So many symbols. 2022, Japan. It doesn't say who made it. Very cute. All right, we're saving the, this for last. Look at this little guy. This is like a early 80s Woodstock bean bag from Butterfly Originals. <laughs> How awesome is that? I don't think I've ever seen them with the tag. It's a little banged up, but it's got the tag. And that makes me super happy. He is, he's really heavy because he, he is full of like beans. Uh, it's more like walnut shells. Yeah, I think it says crushed nut shells so i don't think you could get away with that today with so many nut allergies and we have a note from jean schultz so this was a springtime box so thank you snoopy's gallery and gift shop for this belated opening of a mystery box 
And that's it. That's it for this mystery box. I hope you enjoyed that. And the toy box. Um, yeah. I don't know what you want me to open. Is I, I will open the, the pillow later and I will post a picture for you, Bobby. Oh. And hello, Rose. Welcome. I feel like I should move this over so I don't look like I'm just leaning out of frame. Oh, you... The museum was closed. I feel so sorry for you, M. Hay. Oh. I do have some Peanuts toys and books from my childhood. I think I did a video on that a while ago. Um, I... We were going through some old stuff, like old boxes, and uh, I found like my childhood copy of, I think it's a mystery Charlie Brown. So I actually have some of that stuff in a separate spot, so I know not to sell it. <laughs> no, I kept my stuff in impeccable condition, so why would I ever sell it? <laughs> Um, I do have a Snoopy right over there. I should, I, I could try and go get him. Show you my Snoopy from my childhood. Whoa. <laughs> now I gotta get back in here. Okay, wish me luck, guys. Oh. This is my childhood Snoopy. Hopefully you can see him okay. He did not originally come with this shirt, but this is also from my childhood. It's like a Wisconsin Badgers t-shirt that I used to wear. Uh, this is a Knickerbocker Snoopy. His neck is broken. Cause, Cause you know, I just walked around with him like this. Try not to hit my mic. Will, will you just sit nicely in this box here? Oh, there you go. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, Snoopy, Snoopy. So, yeah, this is my childhood Snoopy. I, I got a really big childhood Snoopy. You know, that's why I'm such a big fan. It's because my giant Snoopy. And he, he's not even that my biggest one in my collection anymore. Oh, there goes the wallet. It's fine, though. I have been collecting Snoopy since uh, I was 10. And I've been collecting since 1990. So yeah, like a good 30 years now, plus more than 30 years. Um, obviously when I was 10, I was slowly collecting, but um, you know, once I had a job and sort of turned this into a, I don't know if profitable, profitable is the right word, um, self-sustaining self hobby, then I was able to get a lot more over the years, obviously. Uh, yeah, so looking forward to another lifetime of collecting. <laughs> oh. uh, the wind-ups do wind up, but uh, they usually... Uh, don't work after all these years. If if they do, they work terribly. So I usually just leave them alone. Uh, the Snoopy Chef, he he should probably work okay. Those those usually do well, but the walkers, they, they usually aren't great anymore. Oh, the Nurse Lucy color form set has rerun in it, which is a rarity. 
You don't usually see collectibles with rerun, especially as old as the Nurse Lucy set. Of course, that might have been when rerun was pretty new, so maybe that's how they got them in. That's pretty cool. Thanks for pointing that out, Debbie. All right. I I have a, a temporary dog. Her name is Rosa. She's kind of like uh kind of like a big black lab but not quite <laughs> i'm i'm not sure what her breed is she's got some brown on her though so not not fully black lab but you know just to give you an idea of size all right uh, if if you're wondering what type of dog Molly is, um, we don't know. She's black and white. Uh, yeah, and a bit pink. <laughs> we just got her because she's cute. She kind of looks like Snoopy, so I thought that was kind of cute. Um, you know, I just, I have a type. Kind of type. Ah, Rosa is an Australian Shepherd. <laughs> Thank you, Helen. Oh, wow, Bobby, you, you've been collecting since you were two. Nice. <laughs> yes, the, uh, uh, so, so Molly is our dog. We got her from a rescue, uh, in, what, 2021? Pretty sure. Oh, I'm like the worst dog mom. Maybe, maybe 2020? Alan, no, I think it was 2020. Um, yeah, so we, so we got, we got her a long time ago. Whereas Rosa is like the in-laws dog. They're out of town. We're watching the dog, you know? It, who wants to put a dog in a kennel when they can just hang out at their cousin's house, as it were? <laughs> All right, I'm going to call it there. Thank you so much, guys, for joining us here tonight. Um, you know, uh, uh, follow all the socials so you'll know when we're going to have the next live stream because I'm going to tell everybody to come join us because this has been a blast. I hope you've had a blast. If you have any uh, feedback for me, uh, let me know in the comments down below. You know, keep it civil, keep it nice. Uh, I can't help how awkward I am. So yeah, that, I'm just going to keep being that way. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. So uh, happy collecting, guys. Uh, bye. <laughs> and, and now I have, to, I have to turn it off. Okay, Snoopy's head is going to fall back. He's stable. I don't want him, like, falling back into the shelf. I am, I am very trapped. <sighs> we did it. All right. Goodbye.